All right, today we're gonna to show you how to build an RC hovercraft. We're gonna go over the tools you need, hot glue gun, X-Acto knife, soldering iron, some solder, some kind of heat source. I use a heat gun. You can easily use a blow dryer. Foam board you can buy at the local dollar store. We have a speed build kit available for purchase, and we also have the plans free available online. And a low friction plastic. We provide one in our speed build kits like so. And a micro drone. You can use a number of brands, but we like to use the Inductrix. The first step is to prepare your foam board. If you're building a speed build kit, this means simply removing the pieces. If you're building from scratch, follow the plans to cut it out. Note these two places where you don't want to cut through the back of the paper. We're going to start with these two pieces. We have a foam piece and we have our low friction plastic. I'm going to take my X-Acto knife and just go in between each cut. I'm going to apply a little hot glue to the foam and apply all the way around the edge. Then I'm going to take the foam and flip it over onto the low friction plastic. You can line it up on the back edge right here. Take your heat gun or hair dryer and apply light heat along the edge as you bend the plastic up. And I like to use the table to my advantage and bend it along the table. You're gonna want the plastic to be at a 30 to 40 degree angle. It doesn't have to be perfect, just enough to get over those cracks and carpet. We use the X-Acto knife to go over the score cuts so the foam removes cleanly. Careful not to cut through the back paper. With that done, we just scrape out the foam. Take your second layer with the battery hollowed out part facing down and glue it to your bottom layer. Take these two pieces and glue them on top. Take the next layer and scrape out the center piece. Take these two pieces and attach them to the top. Take your micro drone and use a flathead screwdriver to remove the motor connectors. You do not want to pull on the wires as that can cause damage. Using an X-Acto knife or side snips, cut the frame to separate the motors, keeping them in the same orientation. If you would like to install bigger batteries and have a better connector, we're going to install the power whoop connector. This is totally optional. Before removing your wires, take a picture so you can remember which side's negative and positive. Take your soldering iron, apply some solder, and then apply it to the soldering joint to remove your wire. Expose and tin your wire. And solder it to the board. If you're installing an FPV camera, solder that to the board next. Take your front two motors and glue them into the cutouts on the top layer, making sure your duct is flush with the bottom. Take your back motors and feed the connector through the cutout before gluing it to the fin. You can use a helping tool, such as a flathead, to push through the cutout. Now, if your motors don't have ducts, we have these two pieces right here you can install into the bottom of your aircraft so you can install a motor. Take your flight controller and camera assembly and you're going to glue it right in the space provided. Take your rear motor connectors and plug them into the front of the board and take your front motor connectors and plug it into the back of the board. We have two places you can install your FPV camera. You can choose between first person view on the front or third person view on the tail. If you're using the third person view mount, start with applying hot glue on the bottom. Hold it in place for a good minute to let it dry. Then go back and reinforce the edges with hot glue. Finally, install the camera at the notch at the top of the fin with hot glue. For first person view, simply put a dab of hot glue in this cavity. Make sure your wires are in the groove and your back fins are lined up so we can push it down. Take a moment to test your electronics before you glue the assembly down. Apply four beads of glue, one on each corner of the craft. 
and press down firmly. Now install your battery. Time to start hooving. <laughs> <laughs> it's hooving time. Five, four, three, two, one, go! Oh, you shut up, man! 